it's your boy Rich Long, and I just came here. You already know to keep it real. I have a uh, another word for you guys that um, God is telling me to drop immediately. This word has been building for a couple of days, and um, now it's on my spirit to release it. Um, the Noahs are building arcs. That's right. The Noahs are building arcs. A lot of us have been giving y'all warnings that, um, the darkness is coming. We're in the last days of darkness. Uh, something's about to happen. There's something on the spirit that's manifesting on the physical. Okay. God has given me a vision that the Noahs have been given direction to build arcs and that we're going in two by two. And from what he's showing me, what that means is God is trying to mate us before he gives us word to lock our doors. So for one, he's telling us, get your storehouse ready. For two, he's telling you, clear it out. Right now, nobody should be in your life that you wouldn't allow to be in your house uh, when it's time to lock it down. And the lockdown, it, it's going to be longer than the last one. We know this last lockdown... This shit done went into years. That was in 2000. At the end of 2000 when we got that word about uh, the virus. Now our life is still not going back to normal. And when this next phase happens, phase two, it will be even more drastic. Finances are going to change. Most work is going to be gig work. Uh, a lot of these uh, companies that have y'all working at home, they're going to outsource overseas, so y'all are going to be left jobless. Right now, it's important. Um, nah, I can't drop that word. God's not telling me to drop that. I'm conflicted in the spirit because I've also been given direction not to help anybody with their wealth transfer right now, except a chosen few people. I've just been given word to get the word out because uh, the chosen have been being stolen from. There's an energy on the earth where uh, the wicked are trying to transfer the wealth in our Akasha to their bank accounts through our pain and suffering. And uh, God is punishing them. Everyone who has done that, uh, you're left out of the wealth transfer. And um, you're going to be in poverty. So get your storehouse ready. I repeat, if you have stolen anything from the chosen, mistreated, or used and uh, abused them, uh, abuse your authority with them in their life and have um, tried to transfer the wealth. You know if you're one of the wicked who, who have been involved in this. You're going to be in poverty, so get ready. Um, but for those of y'all who are uh, God's children, God is sending you a mate. If you're not already mated, God is sending you a mate. You are, might have a mate, and God is sending you uh, a divine counterpart to replace them. So if you're Going through something, get ready. God's finna overnight change everything. Um, and for a select few, you're gonna be married unto God. So uh, if you know you've been called to reserve yourself and that God is doing something else with you, that's fine. But um, for the general collective, for uh, God's people, he's giving me a word to stand clear. Look, I see a sign that says, stand clear. Um, he's about to show out in your life. And if you haven't met your divine counterpart already, y'all are going to be going in the ark together. Woo! My God, that's a powerful word. God told me a few years ago that, um, we were going to have battle buddies. That's right. We'll have battle, battle buddies. Me, God has ushered a lot of, um, kingdom connections in my life. And um, some of them have been brief interactions, and that's okay because he'll bring people in your life just for a season. I don't mean uh, none of the people that y'all have been seeing me have any strife with. Not those people. There have been pure godly people that God has put in position in my life to present me with new uh, spaces, uh, new opportunity, all type of things. Um, right now, there's something major that God is working on us with, and he's revealed it, and um, now we're letting it unfold. It's already manifested on the physical, but we're letting it unfold because God showed us our inheritance, and it's the earth. So um, that, with that being said, he's going to uh, make kingdom connections 
for us internationally. It's already uh, happened. So we're going to stand back and let God do what he's doing for us. Um, and for everybody else, I congratulate you on your due season. Uh, be mindful that uh, when God blesses you with a good thing, to preserve it, take care of it, be humble. You know what I'm saying? Don't abuse your divine counterpart. Um, and everything isn't a divine counterpart. Everybody don't have a twin flame. All of that doesn't apply to everybody. This is things that God has yoked together. These things. Um, not what man has done. Not what uh, your lusting has done. It's not about nothing of the flesh. These connections that God is making are with purpose. Destiny connections. When you get with your spouse, it's instant wealth. Instant wealth. You know what I'm saying? Peace. Peace beyond measure. No struggling. Not that there won't be physical things happening because you got to know the enemy is warring on you right now to keep you from these connections. Um, but um, just know it's a good thing. All the things that God is preparing you for is good. In the end, it will be good. Um, a lot of people have been being put through their wilderness season. It's okay. When you come out of it, you'll be substantiated. I'm hearing the words high honor in the spirit realm. Yes, my God. Uh, it's real. I love y'all. Congratulations. Um, be blessed. Keep it real.